I need to borrow some of your guys' brain cells, I think. Please airdrop them to me. <laughs> I don't know, I like the idea of bacon. <laughs> Pink Panthers, but Renaissance, exactly. The carpet is so clean, <laughs> very child-friendly. That's what happens when you underestimate the cat. I may be awake, but there's nothing going on. lovely to see your faces so the lovely sponsor for this video is seven deadly sins grand cross from netmarble they are about to celebrate their four-year anniversary let me give you five reasons to give this game a try number one there is a brand new festival hero transcendent bond for you to enjoy grand cross uses a fun and creative combat system with satisfying animations number three you guys know i'm a big fan of game soundtracks especially when they tie into a powerful story and grand cross just released their eighth production today. The lyrics from this release are written from Elaine's point of view and give a little bit of insight on how she really feels about Bond. Number four, you can get two new characters, Escanor and Purgatory Meliodas. Number five, you guessed it, lots of rewards for you. This event lasts until July 4th, so if you want to experience the beloved story of Seven Deadly Sins firsthand, make sure to click the link in my description, download the game, and get up to 400 diamonds, three festival heroes, and 154 free draws just from logging in. All right, enjoy the rest of the video. Paimon's still trying to wrap her head around that. If Kokomi was only working off of what Paimon told her, how come Paimon can't find the answer? Oh, is Paimon really as dumb as a lavender melon? Yes. Uh, oh, okay. Even though I don't get Welcome it either. <laughs> and all the chat says, yeah. <laughs> I've never seen that expression. Is that new? It's like I've never seen her smile with her teeth. I see. Did I miss conquest stories? No. My thoughts are still kind of stewing. I'm Everybody. like too sleepy. Too sleep to talk about it. I was so busy that I like barely filmed. Literally every night we were like, oh, let's go out and like, let's get some dinner together and we'll like go get some like cool, good, like good Filipino food. We'll walk around the mall. Except one night we did go see uh, Across the Spider-Verse. But every other night, but once we got done with our events, we like fell asleep, we woke up, we ordered dinner, we ate dinner, and then we fell back to sleep. So uh, I didn't even have time to like think about what Conquest was like. Get ready. Hypothesis. Thought always precedes word. And yet, I can't find the words for this moment. It's good to see you, Asta. <gasps> what an entrance. I'll, I'll hear you out. I'll hear you out. I will be hearing you out on this one. <clears throat> Welcome to Herta Space Station. I'm listening. And you are? I'm Dara. Ah, hello, young madam. I've heard so much about you. Young Madam. He obviously has a personality because why else would a robot be so dripped out like that? I'm just saying, he's got drip and he's got personality and he speaks poetically. No like emotionless robot would dress with this much pizzazz. A simple like emotionless robot would most definitely not wear a little thigh strap. A monocle? A monocle for a robot? Why does a robot need a monocle? That can't be for anything but aesthetic. White pants with no oil stains. <laughs> yeah, he's got those permanent pressed. With the with the little bowl tie? He's not just an android, you know? He's, uh, what's the word? Artificial intelligence. I, I have to say it out loud because the term AI just makes me nauseous now. Hashtag AI, hashtag stable diffusion, hashtag AIR, hashtag, um... Tech bro. Screw them kinda, oh no, you, I'm with you. I will hear you out. Oh man, is he really sick? Not even the bread? Just kidding. Give me some. He doesn't like carrots. Wait, my Joshua doesn't like carrots either. I love carrots. The only reason I don't eat carrots more often is because I'm allergic to like the pesticides. But low key, I've been doing better and I can eat raw carrots, but I love credit. I mean carrots, but Joshua doesn't like them. Give me that bread though. He says in Joshua's lore mini that he doesn't like carrots. His love and admiration for his eldest brother Clive is absolute. He is only too proud to have him serve as his first shield. <laughs> his love for carrots less so. <laughs> wow, they put Joshua in this game. I wonder why he's sick. Before I can do that, you need to take care of yourself. Right? 
No, please. I need both of these characters I go inside. It's to, past my bedtime. to be alive by the end of this game. <sighs> it's just a cold, right? Surely. Nothing more serious. Maybe if he ate his vegetables. Carrots are great for your immune system. You're not wrong. Goodness gracious, they're trying to get me to bring these gigantic items. <laughs> First it was a painting, then it's a cannon. And now we're bringing back that giant bulbous puzzle mechanism all by my lonesome. Who do I look like, huh? Jenna? I wish. But I'm loving the gems, so I'll shut my mouth. This is the cost of business. This should be the item in the photo. I'll bring it back <laughs> just by myself. That's <laughs> so funny. Let me just put it in my pocket. Phew. Here, I got your whatever it's called. What? <laughs> so small. What the heck? I shrunk it. What? It's like as small as the cannon now. Yeah, they sh that's how I did it. I shrink rate it. I shrunk it, it enough to fit in my pocket, and then I wasn't actually able to remember the correct size when I brought it back. So <laughs> hopefully that'll do. <laughs> P. P. <laughs> P. <laughs> P. Thank you, Ting <clears throat> Oh my gosh, it's like a smoker. <laughs> P. Amazing revelation, Tingyun. Thank you. P. When Tingyun said P, I really felt that. P. <laughs> really resonated with me. As I have to pee right now. Go pee, girl. Go pee, squirrel. I did enjoy my time in the Philippines. The only part that I didn't like was when <laughs> my flight back was fine. But my flight there, for some reason, I got just like the worst migraine I have literally ever had. It was one of the few times in my life that I was genuinely like, this pain is borderline unbearable. The only other time I felt like that was when I had mono and I, I had like strep throat symptoms and that was just so miserable. Like the migraine is one thing, but if you have had migraines before, you know that they can make you nauseous. So usually when I get migraines, I'm like, I'll lay down, I'll take a nap, I'll take some Advil, I'll eat something and I should feel fine. But you know, over the course of a 12 hour or 14 hour flight, excuse me, where I obviously couldn't like really relax and I had a middle seat and I was between Joshua and a larger gentleman and by that I mean he's just was like really tall tall and like burly I guess so it just like wasn't comfortable so <laughs> around like the 12 hour mark I was like really feeling nauseous like they serve breakfast and one of the things that came with breakfast was like a bread roll with butter and I love bread like I love bread almost more than anything in the world it is my favorite food and I took one bite of the bread and I felt like gagging. Okay, this is not good. <laughs> and I will spare you the details because I know this is a t difficult topic for some people, but I lost the contents of my stomach three times before we landed in the Philippines. Actually, once was after we landed. I forgot about this part. When we were on our van on the way from the being transported from the airport to the hotel, I had to ask to pull over so that I could lose my food once again. It was quite the experience. But other than that, the trip was mostly awesome. <laughs> Mom, I fought up. Why did you fly though? <laughs> to the Philippines? What method of travel would you suggest? A jet? A bus? A jet ski? A boat? Just swim? Teleport waypoint. Oh, of course. That's so stupid. Of course, that was the right choice. I didn't even think about that. Diablo! <laughs> what manner of evil is this? Petals of blood? <laughs> That's me on the plane to the Philippines. Jedi survivor, I barely know her. Good one, Sedge. Good one. You proud of that one? You proud of yourself? No way. Help me. I don't want to fight him right now. <laughs> no. I can't. That's one BD. <laughs> Bush crash simulator. Hello? Uh, you know, I think the cutscene glitched. I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to fall down that. Because what are we standing on? That's not right. Okay. <laughs> uh, two points for immersion. CBD. CBT? CBT, what's that? 
Oh, cognitive behavioral therapy. Oh, okay. Did you search CBT on Google? Yes, I did. <laughs> oh, I, uh, is that weird? Oh, 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 oh. Oh, one time when I was playing through Portal, like the first time I was playing through Portal 2, super long time ago, when I was a bit little baby streamer. How am I? What? Someone came into my chat. Their username was all spelled out, blank and blank torture. I made a joke that I'm like, I'm just gonna call you torture because I'm I ain't saying that. And then they changed their name to regular torture. I wonder what they're up to. I'll never forget that. Are you sure that it's water in that big jar? <laughs> never know. Maybe I'm just really good at hiding my grimaces. What alcohols are clear like this? Just vodka and like some tequila. I can never, I have zero appreciation for drinking alcohol as is. I like fruity drinks and I am not ashamed of it. <laughs> you frighten the life of- uh, I kind of like, I kind of knew she was going to do it, but hearing it was just something else. Paimon's name is Paimon and these two are the Traveler and Kaidahara Kazua. Hello. Hello. My name's Kirara. Kirara. I can't with the pronunciation of her name. It's a little jarring for me. Well, yeah. English doesn't have a, the type oh, thank of you R so much. that's used in Japanese. So it's like, it's kind of uh, doomed from the start. Kirara. <laughs> Kirara. There's kind of nothing they could do about it. They could have not localized pr pronunciations of names, but since they started, they localized the Chinese names and all, all, well, all of them, honestly. It's kind of, they couldn't just like not do it for one character, so. Kirara. Kirara. <laughs> Kirara XD. Berta felt that this would be too easy on you and wanted to add something of her own. And that is why, in this very moment, she has reverse hacked you and located all your interastral network accounts. <laughs> oh. oh! I have all your passwords. <laughs> I have your whole first account. We got your Google. We got your Apple. We got your your Xbox Game Pass. Your Epic Games. We got your Tears of Themis. Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Metaverse, Dark Web, Primos. I just dumped all of your artifacts. I just rolled all of your artifacts into one star artifacts. All of it. Got him. There's a boba coming soon, I hope. We can smoke it into existence. Oh no, not the cardboard straw. Sorry, I will not be doing that today. Don't worry guys, I have something better. Yeah, no soggy paper straws, although I understand the value, but I'd rather just use my own. Oh, okay, that didn't open the shell very well. Did you hear that? <laughs> Thank you for the raid. <laughs> Sorry, we're listening to a ballad right now. Thank you so much for the raid. By the free bird that I've given wings. Oh, on the big board. Oh, gosh. Storm. Louder, my friend. See how the fire in the firmament beckons. Don't you mute me. Listen, I didn't have lyrics for the last part. This will keep you safe. Ooh. Dang it. I didn't get enough gold for this. You drive a hard bargain, Miss Vendor. Scythe, best weapon? Ah, I want Scythe. I only have 40 gold, though. Okay, I will save up. I will save. Oh, I can buy something now. <gasps> Did you raise your prices? Did she raise her prices? It was like a hundred when I was here last. What the heck? What is this inflation cost? It's, it's okay, the one I have is better anyways. Inflation, very mad. It's not nice. <laughs>